Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Paper Mario. In this episode, we venture in further to the fortress area, yes. Cooper Bros. Fortress. So, we still can't open up that crack over there yet. But instead, we're gonna go find up with that yellow... What is up with that yellow jerk? Yellow Koopa Bro. He was doing something to the block up here, so let's go see what... What's happening, basically. Uh, we could... We want to really go through this door, but... We can't really do anything over there, because there's like... A locked door and we need a key for it and there's no way to get a key yet so let's just hit the block and see what happens I'm sure it's gonna be something great um, oh crap uh, yeah basically he just I don't even know how he managed to do that but by hitting the block the floor just kind of disappeared and he's like loser you fell for it <laughs> that's a terrible pun but <laughs> whatever and then the pink ball bomb that, you know how I said we are going to be seeing all these guys later? Well, here we are, so. And then the pink bomb's like, aren't you Mario? And didn't think she'd meet such a famous guy in a place like this. And she's like, I'm Bombette. And she's a ball bomb, yeah, we noticed. So let's go hit the heart block and see what that has for us. And yeah, we kind of did need it, I guess. Let's go talk to some of the prisoners. He's losing hope. Sad and mad and angry. Really angry now. I want out. Those stinking Koopa Bros. They worked us for 25 hours a day. Unreal. <laughs> 25 hours a day. I love this game. <laughs> Alright, so let's go see these other guys. I have to say. I'm sorry, I will simply not obey tyrants anymore. So he's using all his power to break out of here. And he thought for about 5 seconds and he quit. So. Nothing they could do about it. And he's telling us the backstory of the Koopa Bros, how they were just normal Koopa guys, and then uh, they like got corrupted by adventure. So let's talk to Bombette again. Why am I locked up in here? Because I'm a menace of society. No, um, she blew up next to the Koopa Bros, and then they were just like, "F this, f f that," and threw her in the freaking place. So that happened. Bob on Rebellion is what they wanted, and I guess that would be pretty cool. We should make like a side game, Super Mario in the Bob on Rebellion. Okay, no, that's a terrible idea. I'm just pretend I never even said that. We'll be good friends from now on. Hell yeah! So Bombette joins the party, and Bombette she can explode when you press C down. That's her like map. Ability. I learned that she has a body slam, which is just normal. It's just like her normal, like two damage attack if you get the action command right. And then her special ability is bomb, which is like pretty much the most like powerful move you can get this early in the game because I think it, it does like six damage, and it only costs three FP if I recall correctly. Anyways, let's use her to blow up the cracks in the wall. So now we can go and open up crack in that other area, and various other cracks throughout the game. See what I bring to the party? Hell yeah. Oh, an escape route. I guess I never thought about doing that. <laughs> yeah, about that. Teehee, okay, that was a little silly. Yeah, it was. Alright. We can get out now, right? So, can everyone else. And then stuff. <sighs> Oh, I'm yawning a lot, jeez. Okay, um, that guy says we'll find a way out, even though we already blasted out. Oh, that thingy, I never thought about blasting a wall. You're pretty darn smart. Yeah, I know, right? Let's get out of here. I was sad, mad, but now glad. Freedom, yahoo. So all the ball bombs are like, sweet, but this guy still doesn't even realize there's a hole there, even though he's staring right at it. Nothing this way, right? Okay, yeah. So, it's, oh, crap. What's all this noise? In case you bob off forgot, exploding is prohibited inside the fortress. Oh, well. Alright. What in the Mario? So these jerks just jump in and attack us, but even though they had a little cutscene, they're still just regular enemies, so that's not really a problem. Just take them out like that. 
body slam. Here's the timing on the body slam. Maybe you just do that and bam, done. You just hold A until the bar reaches the little star thing. And you release. It's really, really simple. Alright, so let's just keep on jumping. And let's... Uh, yeah, let's not show off bomb on, on bob bombs. That'd be a bad idea. So just hold it and let go. Done. Two damage. But actually, I really should have had Cooper out for this fight because... Ow. So, there's the... Like, I guess I really never showed how the ball bombs, like, explode. And I guess that's how they do it. And it does two damage. So let's see what happens if somebody's not Cooper attacks so That happens. So basically nothing because... Well, that's not even really anywhere, but I guess she gets, like, a status ailment, kind of, if you, uh, did that and the battle continued. And those guys drop a crap load of coins, so we'll just yoink those and continue on. Alright, let's go up the staircase. Uh, yeah. Let's go to the right and climb back up, I guess. Yeah. Climb all the way back up over here. Actually, wait. Hold on. Wasn't there the... Yeah, there was. There's like a crack down there that we can now open up with uh, Bombette. So let's go and do that instead, actually. Let's just see what's going on out there. Yeah, right here. And explode. Let's go outside. Okay, yeah, we actually are outside. And there's a treasure chest with... The refund badge! Refund some coins if you use an item in battle. So, like, if I used a mushroom in battle, I guess I'd get some of the coins back. Also, just want to make sure there's no star piece out here behind anything that I can't see. I don't think there is, but I'm just kind of paranoid about it, so, I don't know. Yeah, because I never really got all the star pieces at any point in time when I played through this game. It's also just quickly safe. Yes, we want to save. Alright. Just keep continuing on, I guess. And ow, freaking jerk. Just out of nowhere first strike. And yeah, once again I should probably have Cooper out for this fight, but instead I'm an idiot and I have Bombad out again. Uh, no, let's still not show off bomb yet. Just body slam. There we go. And block these guys. Shouldn't be too hard. A frickin'. As soon as I say blocking isn't hard at all, it just happens. Okay, let's pull a Cooper. So we can actually do something against these guys. Ow, I just stubbed my toe on my desk. Ah, oh, Frick. Okay, I'm okay. <laughs> that was stupid. Alright, so let's just quickly take care of this guy. Just a little tap from Cooper. Done and done. Hey, we're getting pretty close to a level up, actually. 78. And we need a key over here, like I said. So let's go back down there through this hole. Go to the left, and then Bombette can help us out. Um, yeah, Cooper, you can't do anything. I meant to press C right. There we go. Bombette, explode on this, please. Thank you very much. Fortress key. And I think, yeah, there is another place that bottom that can explode, but I don't really get it, because I'm pretty sure this is the place that we can just sneak in from the side, so... I don't think there's any star piece in here either, I'm just... I want to check quickly, but I, I don't think so. And there's another key in there, but the only way we can get it is by jumping up on this thing, which we can't yet, so... We'll be coming back here later, though. So anyways, let's just climb way, way back up to the top of the thing and do a thing with that. 
Hooray for being just completely vague and yeah. Yeah, basically we just want to go up and unlock the door and then um I don't really remember after that actually, but <laughs> yeah. Also, somebody was saying something about like um spinning and then jumping to keep the momentum, but I don't really get what they're saying. To me it just seems faster to just keep on sliding. Uh, I I yeah, I don't know. Oh right, this puzzle. It's okay, yeah, it's really easy. All you do is just take out Cooper and hit this, and then all these things shoot out. And then what you want to do is just walk across and hit it from the other side. And then you basically just do that twice, and that's the whole thing. And then you walk across. That thing. And then you walk across again. Hit the thing. And that was the whole puzzle. I guess it's kind of an appropriate puzzle for World 1, but whatever. Now let's move on over here, and there's a Koopa, and... Okay. <laughs> just wanted to try and get the first strike. Oh, wow, there's a lot of guys here. Okay, let's just quickly finish off these guys, I guess. Uh... Uh, I, I could power shell, but then the bombs would be all over me, so let's just take them out one by one as per usual, I guess. Block there. Block this. And hopefully block this. Okay. <laughs> Kinda scared about talking when I'm gonna block something now, because it seems like every time I do that, I screw up the action command. There we go. Hope we can't do anything, and these guys just keep on jumping. It's funny, I never knew Bob Bombs could actually jump until this game, apparently, but I guess they can. Well, I guess Nintendo isn't really um, consistent throughout all their games. So let's just do nothing here, and uh, so that way Mario doesn't have to attack a Bob Bomb that's about to explode. Oops, yeah, I did not mean to do that. I meant to do that. There we go. Explosions. Lock. And there we go. And there we go. Let's grab our eight star points and get the heck out of here. Well, let's not get the heck out of here, but let's grab our eight star points and hit that switch in a second because we need another key over there. And I guess you guys know exactly where I'm going to get it probably by now. I just said we'd be coming back there like, I don't know, a minute ago. So basically the staircase lowers, and then you can jump up on the cement thing down there, and grab the key. So let's go do that. Well, we need to also explode with Bombette. I don't really get the point in having, like, this, the wall there, because, like, there's no possible way you could get to the staircase to lower it without Bombette. Whatever. There we go. We got the key. Let's just get Cooper out again in case there's some more ball bombs, which I'm almost positive there are. Well, that's pretty much all we have time for this episode, guys. So let's use the fortress key and unlock the door. And I guess we're going to end this one right here. So thanks for tuning in for another episode of Let's Play Paper Mario with Christian as your host. I will be seeing you guys next time when we hopefully finish up this area and beat the Cooper Bros. See you guys then. <laughs>